Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today I will be drawing a small house mouse. So I hope you like it. Now let's get started. I'm going to start off with the eye first so you can see that circle. So if you are new to my channel and haven't been here already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video for you every single day and along the way while I draw I will give you some fun facts about what I draw. So today I will be reading uh, the website pestworld.org that's where I'm getting all my fun facts from and I will also show you some details of my drawings and as you can see so like I said I'm starting off with the eye and I'm going to go to the face area and then finish it off with the body. It's going to be one of those little cute mouse that uh, run around. Uh, hopefully not in your house but around. Um, they are, if they get infested, they just multiply like crazy. So it says on this website, if you have a mouse infestation, Rest assured, you're not alone. Each winter, mice and other rodents invade an estimated 21 million homes in the United States. Mice typically enter our homes between October and February looking for food, water, and shelter from the cold. So, have to be careful. And if you see a small hole um, uh, on your garage or an uh, opening, into your house, cover it up so that they can't enter. So if you have any fun facts that you would like to share, comment below and let me know. And also you can always connect with me through Facebook, Instagram or even Twitter. So connect with me there as well. And if you have any questions, comments, also requests for me to draw for next time, let me know in the comments below and I will draw that for you for next time as well. And if you want to send me your drawings as well, you can send it to my Facebook or my Instagram. Then I can feature it in my next upcoming videos if you like as well. So to give you more fun facts, uh, they do have a big appetite. So despite their tiny bodies and even smaller stomachs, mice eat between 15 and 20 times a day. Because of their frequent eating habits, they prefer to build their homes near food sources. Oh, scary. And mice are good jumpers, climbers and swimmers. In fact, mice can jump a foot into the air, allowing them to easily climb up onto kitchen counters or into pantries to access food. To prevent mice and other pests from getting into your food, store all pantry items um, in hard plastic containers with a tightly sealed lid. So if you have a mice infestation, Apparently that's what you should do and if you don't as well I guess it's a good idea to start doing that so they don't come. However, even though they do crazy things and they are a um, really bad thing to have around your house, um, they are very cute. I find them very cute, especially because they are very tiny um, and furry, so I find them very cute, but um, I don't want them in my house. And um, mice can squeeze through openings as small as the size of a dime. So this means that a small crack or opening on the exterior of your home, that's what I was talking about before, such as where utility pipes enter, is likely an open door for mice. 
So prevent mice from gaining access to your home by sealing any openings on the exterior with a silicone cork. And you can also fill gaps and holes inside your homes with steel wool as well. So they can't squeeze through those. So going back to the drawing, now you can see that the whole mouse uh, itself is done. Now we just have to add in the details for the eye and the fur. I will also show you how I colored it as well so you can get an idea. But there are so many, they are like cows, they come, in, they come spotty, they come in brown color, white. Um, so they have so many different colors so it's up to you which color that you want to use and there is a cute picture on this website as well of a mouse looking up and that's a black and white spotty mouse it's a very cute looking one with a pink nose um, so like i said before the website is pestworld.org if you want to check that out as well So to give you more fun facts, um, you know that mice can spread disease like um, hantavirus and salmonella, but that's just the beginning. In fact, mice can actually carry as many as 200 human pathogens. Ew. Okay. So in the wild, mice usually only live for about five months, mostly because of predators such as cats, snakes, and foxes. In a lab setting, mice can live for up to two years, hmm. but they get tortured in a lab. So probably a bad idea to live longer. So if you had a mice problem and if you solved it and if you want to share that with everyone you can comment below and share that so that if other people are having the same issue that they can uh, do the same thing and get rid of this um, uh, pest I guess and um, they are really a bad pest to have because uh, if you have one it does not take long for it to be many so a female mouse can give birth when they are only two months old and they are able to have up to dozen babies every three weeks this means she could have as many as 150 offspring in a single year so you do not want at least one of them inside your house. If you spot a mouse in your house, it's safe to assume there are more or there will be soon. So um, it says on this website, it's best to talk or call a pest professional before the investigation grows out of control. So there you go, some advice there from this website. And I'm sure um, these tips are very useful and I thought they were fun. So I hope you found those fun as well. So going back to the drawing now you can see that we are coloring and I'm using just brown and darker and lighter shades of brown and some um, pink as well. So to show you the full color drawing, this is the full color drawing. I really hope you like it. And if you do, don't forget to hit that like button and leave a comment for me. 
and if you would like to buy products with this on check out my redbubble shop link in the description box below for products i hope you love those as well and i'm going to put some next videos for you to check out next i really hope you like them and don't forget to hit on my face logo to subscribe to my channel i bring a video every single day to you so i hope you have a great great day today and i will see you tomorrow as always and you enjoy your day and i hope you draw things with me and i hope you like this mouse so bye for now bye